So I decided that the theme customizer was something you really couldn't understand unless you saw it in action. So what I've got here is the theme customizer running on 2011 with uh, actually one of the latest patches that will be going into 3.4 as soon as we work out the minor few bugs. But you can see uh, some of the changes so that I can edit a title in real time and see the change happen live. Uh, you can change the tagline. You can change things like the header, turn it on or off, change the text color of it. Again, real time. Not everything is real time. Obviously, turning the header on and off can take a second sometimes to refresh. In this case, it's not actually refreshing because I've disabled that. But some things like, uh, for example, the link color, which are these bits here do not change in real time. So if I change it to red, you see it starts to refresh and then you've got red. Um, if I change the color scheme, it has to reload the whole page in order to use the new CSS for the dark color scheme. So it takes a second on some things, but the real time changing is what we're currently working on, um, or what I'm currently working on, and it lets you preview exactly what you're going to see on, on the real page in real time. Uh, now while I'm doing this, if I go and look at the actual site, you'll see nothing's changing. Uh, it's This is only changing for the, the theme previewer screen. Um, but I think it's a much better way to, to deal with options and to, uh, to sort of see what you're doing as you're doing it. Uh, we're going to be trying to make as many elements to update in real time as possible using the post message method. And in the tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change your theme to move your options, your things like that, into the customizer and make your site as custom as you want it to be.